welcome back to my channel and welcome to another weekend vlog. Um, I wanted to pop on real quick. It is Friday morning. I believe it's about 10 o'clock. Um, and I just kind of wanted to catch up with you guys because I feel like this week has not gone as planned. <laughs> Looking at my planner, like this is one of those weeks and excuse my laundry if you can hear it. Um, but this is one of those weeks where like I plan out a million things and do nothing. Like that was this week. So if you're having a week like that, you're not alone. Or if you've ever had a week like that, you're definitely not alone. I think um, productivity and motivation comes in waves for some. For me, there's weeks where I am doing all the things and I feel like a freaking rock star. Got me a pillow. She's playing her new Play-Doh. And then there's weeks where I feel like a complete failure. And I have to be super honest, this week was one of those weeks. Um, I believe I only uploaded one video, um, but not just so much a failure as far as YouTube comes, but just in general in life, my house is a tornado. Um, so what is the, I, yeah, I'll charge it in a little bit. She hasn't talked to me in the two hours we've been home, but as soon as I turn on this phone, she comes running. I will charge your iPad, okay? You can be on the video, but you have to come stand over here. You can't talk over there. They can't see you. <laughs> so anyways, um, it was one of those. Um, James has stepped up in the last couple of years. And not only that, just he knows when I'm having a bad week, like he's learned to find those cues and things like that. And that's just hum being human. Um, but he has really stepped up this week. He did some laundry. He's He cleaned our room. He's been doing dishes and things like that. But here's my deal. So I have a really great routine. <clears throat> Love routines. I'm a routine type of person. I have a really great routine. But as soon as I add in one thing, my whole life goes to crap most of the time that's just being real and what did i add in i added in going to the gym which i had been doing before and doing fine but i'm actually like do going to the gym and working out really hard um because you know i had been going to the gym and just doing walking or doing cardio and this and that and i did start weight training again this week so it's to be expected my energy level is super low um I have to give myself grace understanding that yeah i am working out hard it is important to me even though i want to give up it's friday i'm like my house is a mess i'm exhausted i can't do this i can't do this but it's something that i need to do because i need to be healthy i need to be it makes me happy being healthy makes me happy you know not being extra fluffy makes me happy so it's it's sort of a thing that i have to do for my mental health but I have to get adjusted and I have to be patient with myself. So that has been how my week has been going. Um, other than that, me working out and my house going to crap. Other things we've dealt with is Camila did have her cast off for the surgery that she had on her finger. The doctor looked at it and he decided he wanted to cast it again for two more weeks to make sure it heals correctly this time. This is a revision from 2017. She didn't heal correctly, so he's just being extra cautious and wants to make sure that her finger heals um, correctly. So she did get a cute pink cast, which is super cute. You have to be slow with him. That's scary. What if I'm fast? <laughs> then he's gonna bite What you. if I'm oh, fast? Oh. Yeah, I'm not scared of this, but Bruh. I don't, don't want to. Ryan is so scared. All right, hey y'all, it has been a while. Um, I just dropped off Reagan and all his friends at the soccer night. James got home from a job, ate, and then got called out for another job. Which is a good thing, but a bad thing, because now we're stuck at home. Yeah, today was her school dance. So after I dropped off Reagan, I ran right into the Dollar General. And look what I found the kids. Sour Patch ice cream. So I'm about to serve them some ice cream. I just got done washing dishes and then I'm gonna fold the laundry and then I'm gonna rest because I spent the whole day cleaning up.
No, she didn't. She I beat Mr. T. Look at that. That's on the eight ball. He's got one Where's ball that? over there. Because we left her Elmo, so that baby, and now we gotta go get to Elmo. Go get it. <laughs> I only got one baby. Okay. Our first basketball game. There's your Elmo. Look, Elmo can sit with your baby. There, mom fixed it. Mom saved the day. <laughs> That way, I think, right? Or what? This way. cold hot cold hot cold that's texas for you it is officially <laughs> baseball season well not really but this is our first game on a sunday which sucks but that's how it goes for baseball in texas so the girls are with my mom oh the girls and ding are with my mom i have a long sleeve, a sweater, a jacket, another jacket, and a huge blanket, gloves, and a scarf. I hate being cold. So, we have to be there at 8. We're not going to rail yard, you know, right? We're going to 151. Okay. I'm just kind of concerned about time. Um, so, anyways. I'll see you guys on the baseball fields. Yeah. I'm gonna cheddar up and we'll eat them there. What? You wanna we eat them inside without hurting? Uh, let me see. I wanna. Look at the conchas. I always forget to show what we eat. <laughs> We're eating barbacoa with avocado. Gotta have the big bread. You're from Texas, South Texas. You know what's up. These are cheap. Chicharrones, right? Chicharrones. We have tamales for Reggae Poo. Best tamales in town, bro. Yeah. Reyes has the best tamales. video breakfast I'll have to show you guys from my Instagram if for some reason I didn't video breakfast so good we went to Thea's 
We should have brought those tamales in here, man. We have tamales left over, um, but we left them at home. But I don't know if you guys can hear me because the compressor's on, so we will catch you guys for dinner, hopefully. We finally get to eat, and our favorite pizza was on the way home. Gotta love Constantino's. Best pizza ever. I am the worst <laughs> vlogger of life. Why do I never remember to show my food? Pizza, wings, James had a sandwich. <laughs> That's gross too, like to show you the food. I right know, here. I know, my bad, my bad. <laughs> brownie, homemade brownie, chocolate chunks. This part is for my Reiki baby. Jags! At the pizza place. Call us. Holla. Look at all those wings they're making. I wonder why they're making wings. Maybe. They must be catering for something. Yeah, that's why they got it all going on, right? Alright, hey guys, happy Monday. It is Martin Luther King Day. Happy Martin Luther King Day. I am ending out our weekend vlog with a quick Walmart haul. Um, I got a few things to make three dinners um, this week, and then I got some other little things that I needed. The kids' science fair projects are due. Kyla's is literally due tomorrow. I have not started it. Yeah, that is my life. And they are required at our um, school. Hold on. And then Dane's is due on the 23rd, which I believe is Thursday. So I picked Dane up his board. Kyla got her board from school. I did run into Sam's because on Wednesday is Camila's birthday. And so I went ahead and ordered her um, her frozen cake from Sam's. And then um, I picked up this three pack of Alfredo sauce because one of our dinners this week is going to be a chicken Alfredo bake. I also picked up this huge pack of boneless skinless chicken breasts. I love to get it at Sam's. 10 bucks for this giant pack. It is six pounds you guys so that is enough for two meals for us tonight we are maybe even three honestly tonight we're having chicken and rice soup um so that's one meal and then the other one is the alfredo bake which goes with this and i may just um save two of the chicken breasts if there's too much and i have some other chicken breasts so i can combine those to make a third meal um james asked me to pick him up some tire shine he's outside cleaning the car the trucks, cleaning the trucks, and he also needed two cans of starting fluid. Boring, that's his bag. Let's see, I went ahead and picked up the pack of penne pasta for the Alfredo bake. I also got beef broth for the fideo that we're gonna be eating. This is the white rice that I used for the chicken and rice soup. We needed a gallon of milk. So I went ahead and got that. This is the French bread that I'm going to make with our soup tonight. I just picked up a quick bag of this Captain Crunch for cereal this week. Um, I got two huge cans of tomato sauce because I need these for the fideo. This is the 29 ounces. Um, we put, I put green beans in the soup that I'm making. It's pretty much just boneless, skinless chicken breast green beans drained and then put into the soup and uh, white rice. So um, I believe James's mom used to make it for him when he was little and I've been always making it for our family for quite some time now. I'm gonna throw some broccoli into the um, chicken Alfredo bake. So it's gonna be penne pasta, chicken breast, Alfredo sauce and broccoli. So they didn't have the little boxes of fideo that I'm used to. So I just got two bags of fideo. I'm sure it'll be the same. And then this is the ground beef that I use for the fideo. I use the full three pounds. Normally two boxes of the noodles, so I may only use one bag. They look a little big, I'm not too sure. The full two cans of tomato sauce and then some beef broth and some other seasonings that I put in there. Um, but yeah, it does use all of that. Um, I got these cheddar biscuits. They were on clearance for a dollar. Um, so I thought we could eat those the night we eat the Alfredo bake. Um, I got this party pack of fruit snacks because I'm actually going to be probably doing a video 
on how to make dulces enchilados. <clears throat> so I'll probably be using that chamoy and this trechas. That will be coming soon. I got the um, these Alka-Seltzer tabs. So Dane's science project is going to be what makes them explode faster. If they're in one piece, if they're in half, or if they're all crumbled up, like what reacts faster. So that's for that. I am, even though I ordered Camila her frozen cake from Sam's, I ordered a small one because I am going to be making her some pretzel rods and some chocolate covered strawberries. So I got um, these cute little frozen, sorry. <laughs> These cute little frozen marshmallows were only like a dollar or two. I think they were like two dollars. I don't remember. But I figured maybe I can put them on the pretzel rods or on like put a toothpick um, or put them like on a skewer or something. I don't know. I just thought I could do something cute with them. I ate this <laughs> while I was shopping. It's so good. These are the paninos. Um, they made it now with jalapeno jack cheese. Oh my God. It's so much better than the other one which is the hard salami with just the white cheese. These are for the frozen pretzel rods. And then these are for the, this is just a packet of sprinkles for the frozen covered, for, not frozen, covered. The covered strawberries, frozen theme, and for the pretzel rods, I'm gonna use those. And then um, we have, we um, got rid of our cable last month and so we just stream stuff, but sometimes our internet doesn't work really well because we live out in the country. So I've been meaning to pick Camila up some DVDs that are for her, like when she's home by herself during the day. So they had this PBS Kids. Um, it is 20 music tales, get up and dance, four hours of fun. And it was only $3.74. It has Caillou, Daniel Tiger's Neighborhood, Dinosaur Train, Nature Cat, Odd Squad, Peg and Cat, Reading Rainbow, Wild Kratz, and Word World. So I figured she would really like that for $4. You cannot beat that. Um, so that is my odd Walmart haul. I thought I would check in with you guys. I did film my Plan With Me video, which is gonna be going up here as soon as I get done filming this. Um, and then I also filmed um, how I do my nails at home. I know I've mentioned it before, so it's like salon shellac. So that video will be coming up this week. Also, probably a vlog of Camila's birthday, and we'll see what else we have going on. Um, I know I have science projects, which I need to get started on. So, uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and end it here because I have to put all this away, cook dinner, and then I have to do science project, and it's just, it's not going to be fun, people. It's not going to be fun. <laughs> so, thank you guys so much for watching another weekend vlog with us. Um, please like this video and subscribe, and we will see you guys next time.